Concert Daily, folks. Check yes. it out. Yes, Concert Daily. <laughs>
And it's so humbling to see this brother go to uh, Germany and come to America, you know, and, and he understands that. He understands that the, the Jesse Smollett, the actor, is one thing, and the Jesse Smollett, the singer, is another thing. The Jesse is going to do great things, and I'm just so glad to call him my brother. You know, and then June's Diary, you know, five girls, you know, I'm, I, it's, a, it's a lot. It's expensive. Uh, you know, it's a lot of my money right now. And, and you know, and that's I, the love. You know, and I just have to invest in something I believe in. You know, people are going to really find out what's going on in a minute. There's a lot of stuff going on. You know, the devil is a liar. Okay? And, uh, and, and what I try to teach the girls is to always put out good. Let's be humble. Let me be the a-hole because I'm not the one out front. I'm not being a-hole just to purposely be the a-hole. I'm being a-hole to make sure that people respect these girls. These girls are great. You know, I wish BET would support us a little more. You know, I think that we were born on BET. You know, why don't we get to just do a red carpet or something? You know, uh, shout out to BET for giving us the opportunity to put the girl group together. But I want to thank Jesse Smollett. I want to thank Escape. I want to thank Mona Scott. I want to thank Involve. I want to thank Kelly Rowland. I want to thank anybody who's been here and given us a hand. You know, the girls are doing this new makeup line. I want to thank them. I want to thank Fresh Dolls. You know, we, we, I want to thank Spirit Airlines. You know, yeah. you, you'll be amazed how we're trying to pull this off. I want to thank my mama for giving up her bedroom at my house, you know, for the girls, my sister, my sister for being a taxi driver. I want to thank Chris Grant. I want to thank uh, Jasmine Harper for choreographing for free. Y'all yeah. just don't know the struggle was real, but these and girls deserve. Yes, Chris Grant and Chris Grant and Jasmine did hurt people. You know, yeah, thank you. You know, so it's just a, it's been a struggle, but we're gonna hang in there because it's happening. Our dreams are just about to come true. Yes. Because we just we, just, our dreams are just about to come true because we're opening our, opening our eyes. You know, uh, and we do have an EP coming real soon, folks. Just so you know. Yes. But we, we have just one can't. Out too right now called yeah, but that's not an EP. That was just a mixtape. Okay. You know, the thing about a mixtape, and people are going to probably complain, well, that's a mixtape, and those are covers. You know, you know, we have a lot of music out there, but, you know, we, but, but we're trying to build our fan base. People always reading us and talking bad about us on Instagram because they were saying, well, when are you going to put some music out? Hell, we got 10 songs out. They may not be all on iTunes, but we got 10 songs out. But we got to build a fan base. The girls only have 126,000 followers, you know. Uh, some people have 110 million followers, you know, so you, you got to understand that tells you a lot. A lot of people don't know who the hell June's Diary is. You know, a lot of people don't know who Jesse Smollett is as the singer and dancer. So we're out here grinding to make sure people know who we are. And then when we put a project out there, hopefully it will stick. OK, and that's my goal. I think what you just said is very powerful for any and every artist trying to do anything. Patience, work ethic, and just sticking to it, being persistent is very much so key. Yeah. Okay, once again, I can be the a-hole because I'm just pushing people, not to be an a-hole purpose. But you're not. Okay, but the girls have to be humble. They have to be sweet. They have to be considerate. They have to communicate. They can never seem like a prima donna. Beyonce is the sweetest person I've ever worked with in my life. Michael Jackson is the sweetest person that I ever worked with in my life. An a-hole gets nowhere. Because you, if, if you're a hole to these people who are buying your music and your tickets, they shouldn't buy your music and tickets. You have to be like royalty. Royalty, I love when I see the Prince Charles and all those folks. They're taught to be humble. They're taught to be gracious. They're taught to be humble. I have to say that again. And, 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 and that's what I teach the girls. Even when they're tired, when they come out of those rooms, you, you got to be up. You got to be uh, uh, like, here we are. Thank you, 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 thank you. And it's hard sometimes. It's hard when people are pulling at your coattail and you look all greasy and, and, and you look like you just woke up and you don't want to take a picture. That's what sunglasses are for. Put the sunglasses on. That sunglasses are not to look all cool and pretentious. Sunglasses are automatic makeup, I call it. Okay. okay. Love it. I love all of your reasons behind everything. I think you show your heart. You wear it on your sleeves. You know your business. You know your purpose. And I think that's so powerful. I just want to congratulate you for everything you have done, created the foundation you've laid. Like, it's, you're, in, you're incredible. And you are highly blessed. Thank you so much for taking this time with us. I so appreciate it. I really appreciate you.